Off day is the off day. This is the off day show. But even even the people that have company behind their back, they're not even doing it like I'm doing it. Yeah. So imagine if I have one company behind my back and they are supporting me and I'm promoting them. Imagine the heights we're going to take this to. Yeah. I, I, I you think, understand? So. Yes, yes. I, I, I agree with you because you, you, you're you doing it the right way. And and, that, and that's the reason why they sabotage me so that people don't come to patronize me. Because they know my zeal is to make music for the people of which they don't have. Yes, yes, yes. And and will you will you so, see yourself will you see yourself like a controversial artist? Will I ask you, will you say you're a controversial artist? The media, the media can make me as controversial as they want, but I don't care. I'm just doing me. I'm just doing what the fans want. Okay. Okay. I don't I don't make I don't I don't make music for the media. My personality is not for the media. I make my music for the fans. And I live my life for my people around me. I don't live my life for the media or live my life for people that want to tell, tell me I did good or I did bad. I live my life the way I, I live my life. Okay. Okay. By, by your own standards. And by what people are going to say about me. They want to say, oh, God, oh, God, God. Like, I don't worry about no, nothing. But one step at a time, everyone will jag at us. Yes, yes. Uh, so, uh, I, I, okay. Um, are, are you are you going on any tour soon? Like any tour to around the country? Do you have a plan for a tour? Uh, right now, I put the album out. When I put the album out, and then uh, people can get to feel the new me. Okay. Put some videos out. People get to yes. I people saw get that. to see the new me. You know, and then uh, after that. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Okay. I know Europe is calling. I know yes. Europe is waiting for us yes. to come through. Yes, yes. That's what I'm asking. Europe, Europe, Europe should take it easy. We are coming very soon. Yes, because I think it's coming. about time. It's about time to tour the world now. Because you have been on the you have been in the news and you have actually been been working too for some time. So I think your fans will want to see you, even even not internationally, even locally, like around the country. I think some of your fans will want to see you too in shows. So I think it would be a lovely thing to have Rocksteady and um, um, and the whole crew, Mala Spicy. And Mala Spicy, uh, Ras All of us going on. All of us going on tour, yeah? Okay. I think that's going to be, going to be great. But anytime, I, do you have a date for the EP? Do you have a day? When, are, when is the EP? When are we expecting? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking like, I'm looking at August, August 26th or August 26th. Okay, can you see me now? Yeah, so okay, so we'll just continue. Um, um, we'll, we'll just continue. I wanted to ask you, uh, do, you do you have plans to have young artists to sign young artists like to have apart from the, the Fragona, your group? You know, we have young artists that are talented right now, and you're talking about 
you know, setting it right for the new younger generation. Right? Are you going to sign your and use the 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 that we're talking about? Yeah, right now, right now, I got some artists that I'm working with. Um, I signed a, a, an artist. It's gonna be one of the biggest stars Nigerians uh, Nigerians have ever seen. His name is called V Five. Wow. I just signed him, wow. and um, I also have um, normally my 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 my, my prodigies like Rocksteady is signed to Lada Entertainment now, and then um, there's uh, some new artists again I'm working with like this Emma Young. Um, you're gonna hear his new single is gonna come out. It's called Paper. Um, so we on Ladders Entertainment, we have some artists already that we want to put out. And Plantation Boys is also on our stable, as well as Blackface Ninja is on our stable, okay. you know. Okay. So you, you'll be rest assured that we're going to bring out music and bring out some new, more new art, so many entries, so many people selling us their record. But we're, we're taking our time and not to, you know, just jump into an artist. We need to check them, how they live their life of doing music and how they live their life in reality. So we don't sign an artist that gives us problems because having having the talent is one and having the the um the the character to carry the, the, the talent is another. You know, so we're really, really skeptical about that. So we're taking our time. But now we've already discovered that that's like V5 is really really um somebody that um Nigerians should watch out for. Um, his single, we just put his single out, I Want You Back, you know, produced by Three Shells, is out right now. Okay. And um, very soon we're going to have that song on all platforms. You're going to know how how much Nigerians are really involved. And V5 is just a testimony of of um, what the the evolution of Nigerian music is all about. Yes. And I'm, we are really privileged as Lada Entertainment to have signed an artist like that, you know, in this 2022. And we want the people to, to get to understand that new artists, new more artists will be coming and they should embrace them and they should support them so that these people don't do something else and be on the streets doing things that are, that are bad to society because let's support their talent and let's have a you know, and I have a, a peaceful country. You, you know, that's the that's the reason why we're doing this. Okay. You know. Okay, okay, that's that's really lovely, Black, because you can because what you're talking about, concerned about the future industry and the music they're making now, it's it's also to make sense for you to have your own artist to set that standard. So we'll watch out for it. We'll watch yes. Out for him. We'll watch out. We we'll really watch out for him. And um, do you guys? Do yeah, you watch out. Watch out, Benny. Do you have a partner in the label, or are you just doing it alone? Or you have like a partner that is working with you? Well, I have some partners. I have some partners. I have some partners. I'm just a, I'm just a, a shareholder. I have some partners. Yeah. You know, and um, and I, I did, apart from V Five in our stable, we still have people like them, Skinny Rose. You know, and um, you're gonna feel their music. We got Bayonet. We got Freedom Blaze. You know, there's Ilvin. Ilvin is really bad with the flows. So we have this big family. We are all a big family. And uh, they, sorry, Black. Are they people, person, people, sorry, Black. Are they versatile artists? Are they like what? Are, what are their genres of music? Are they hip hop or rap? Oh, they're versatile. They, they're, they're really, they're really versatile. They're versatile because you know when you wait. If, if if I'm a coach and I'm signing a player, and I want to sign a striker, I will sign a striker who is also defensive as well. Who would like to go back to defend? So I need to get an artist that can also sing reggae, sing R and B, can do rap. You know, and you know that's the kind of uh, team we want to build. Yes, because the the, the music keep evol keep changing, and as the evolution keeps exactly, changing, and the that, and that, that can change with time. And the well. artist that can always be ex exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. Before I go, I want to share something with you. That's if you can still remember some time ago. Because if I don't say okay. this, I will not forgive myself. In Port Harcourt, in I think is it 2000, we had a show. I don't know if you remember Chooks and Dancy. They actually were two show promoters. They used to bring artists to Nyack. Yeah, Chooks and Dancy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, I remember there was a show we had in Integrated Cultural Center in Port Harcourt. Uh, that was the Plantation Voice. And there was one hotel in. Rumudara or Poro Road, 
we all were stuck in the hotel because the show there, there was not enough promotion publicity in the show so the show apparently flopped and i remember there was no even fair for dancing and troops to pay us me i was in the hotel with you laugh face and face at that time it was called shepherd hotel and we're there for two weeks i used to come to your room lots of times too as well but you will not remember now okay. the young dude by then i think that was one of the that was one of the key moments that i i studied you i studied two face i studied face as a group because we're all together in that hotel for over two weeks and that's how i knew the power of everybody and i became friends with everybody even if i was not too close to you then but i respected you i respected your 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 music sense because you did some freestyles in the room that day and we're all together that day and that also inspired me to become who i am today you know so i want to i just wanted to mention that mm, nice. yes i just wanted to nice it's, it's just the way i am i you know i welcome people i don't know yeah. and uh, i don't segregate i don't i don't know like if i didn't like um you know maybe give you an open door for yeah. you to for us to sit down and talk together you know you know you will not be saying you know like you know you will not be saying like you know me yes but there are people that really don't there are people that really don't know me yes and they think they know me and they yes. go around talking about how i am yeah and people that know me really know that that's not me they are talking yes. about yes. so if you if you have been with me like coming coming in two weeks you know Definitely would have eaten together on the yes, table. Yes, we do. Would have shared. Yes. Yeah, of course. And that's how I am. Yes. Because I don't, I, I, I don't know any other way to live. Yes. Because uh, anybody I, that's because I remember. To sorry to come on black. I remember that day. It was only your room that we got access to. Every other two face and face, they were kind of, but you were open to us. I could remember, even if I had chat with Two Face, but I remember that we had access to you. So when sometimes people talk, I always tell people, I know Black. I've, I've been, I've gone to his house. I've been to the Plantation Boys' house in Aquateria in in, in Festac. I've met you. So I, 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 my perception, in fact, that was one of the reasons why I wanted to have you on the yeah. show. Because even if uh, we've known yeah, you, so I've met you a long time ago. So I know your person. And I know it's just that you're a person with, how will I say it? You have you are a principled person so most times your principal have to fall, most time fall out with other people so that's why you don't really agree with you so i think but it's fine yeah you know? like i'll be still i'll be still so, yeah it's all good it comes with the business do you understand yes you can't please everybody you just have to do you yes and be yourself so you guys just get ready more music will be coming okay. more vibes will be coming you know yes okay, okay. okay. you know Yes, I, I, I think I will premiere your video you know? here. We'll put out your video. The one All right. Dropping, we'll promote it here. And I also want to leave with this. I hope you don't get I hope you will not feel some kind of way with this. But I need to also ask this because if I don't ask you, you do not clear my conscience. Even this is my friend. You are my friend. I wanted to I want to know. Yeah. No. Have you guys okay. have you guys Oof. had you had the, the personal you had the pick up, have you? Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, I remember now. Yeah, yeah, can you hear me? Okay, what do you say you want to leave? Yeah, yeah what do you say you want to leave? leave I wanted to ask this before I leave. As a friend, yes, as a friend, because I know yeah, you are two face were one time friend, even whatever happened. Have you got have you reached out to you as a friend, like personally as a friend, over this uh, African Queen issue to talk? I'm not talking about the media now, I'm talking about the friend who before we mm. knew, you guys were close. Did you reach out at any point? Mm -hmm. Come, let's talk about. This. Well, this is uh, like I don't really, I don't really want to talk about, you know, I don't want to talk about those things that are related to things that has to be controversial. Okay. What's this? What's that? You know, but we have plans to meet. Okay. And um, we have some projects that are lined up for us to do. Wow! Wow! And um, wow. We, we hopefully. Hopefully, we will meet, and then, if if I'd met with him already, I would have been able to give you a concrete answer. Okay. But I've not met with him yet, and I've not met with him yet, and uh, because I'm really, really tied up, I'm really, really busy. Okay, and making the album, I'm in the studio twenty-four seven. Uh, I really, I really go out. I'm all, all, all in my business.
you know so let's see when i have some concrete information about that i will give you guys okay. but for now i want you guys to just know that you know the plantation boys the 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 band is still on yeah. new singles are out there you guys go google plantation boys subscribe to their youtube channel okay. subscribe to um, follow on twitter follow on instagram at plantation boys one you know and um let's let's see if the fact you see we, we are even liverpool is thinking of signing with Ladu back to the midfield so even if two face goes and signs for kenny's music it doesn't mean that Ladders at the team, I cannot say let's sign him yeah. back. Yeah, it's no longer it's no longer in, but let's, it's no longer in Kenneth anymore. So yeah, so he's a, he can be a free agent. So yeah. I want you guys to look at it that way. Yes. Don't look at it like there's a problem, we are fighting. Yes. No, no, no. Don't look, don't look at it that way. Just look at it that people have ambition and they're yes. always trying to be ambitious. Yes. And all I say is ambition is good, chase it. Yes. pursue it achieve your dreams go get it and nothing wrong with that yes I'm, I'm, you I'm, understand yes As, but I, I, I really i really i'm really excited for the man that you're turning out to be black i will not lie like i can see you evolve no for, for 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 real for real for real this is the person i've always been it's just that the media could tell you guys different about me because the media can be hired to write negative yes. about me yes yes uh, okay so it's just that. Yes, yes. Anyway, so thanks for your time. I gotta leave you. I gotta leave you now because I got the. Yes, before the you go, I, I want you to give uh, us a shout out to the show, the off tape show. Just give us a shout out to the show that we can use to win our off the off tape show. Yes. Okay, yo, this is Blackface Nigeria. Bahame is my creep, and you see, it's off tape, and I'm in the off tape show. So you check it out, and um, see you guys on the other side. Boom, Be boom, good. Boom, boom, boom. Thank world. you. Thank you guys. Nigeria. Thank you, Black, for having for being here. It's a pleasure yeah. to have you in the yeah. show. God bless you. Wish you a wonderful shoot in your, your production and wish you a wonderful album. And we're looking forward to the Tribunal album and the Plantation Boys album as well. Thank you, Black. Thank you. Off tape. Yeah. What up, people? It's your boy, Jeff the Roller. You know, that was Blackface. It was awesome to have him uh, in the off tape show. And I think you've learned a lot. They're dropping a new project. The tribal now are coming back again and they are touring the world and Europe. So it's going to also be an exciting time. So thank you. Welcome back, guys, to the Off Tape Show. It's your boy Jeff the Ruler, your host. I hope you learned a lot from our guest today, Blackface Ninja. You know, he spoke a lot about his own side of the story. He spoke a lot about the authenticness of music in the industry. And I, I, I just believe in every episode there's something to learn. You know, it's not about the criticism. Like I said, this show is not to come into conflict with people. Everybody has their own personal life and stories. It's a free world. It's the off tape show and I'm here to document stories of legends and the plantation boys. How can I start documenting Nigerian music without starting, you know, with the likes of the Plantation Boys? And since they are all not together as a group now, although we still have the Plantation Boys, you know, the members like Two Face, Face, and Black Face, you know, with time in the show, hopefully Two Face is my personal and clo uh, personal close friend too as well. I know I've, I've stayed with Black Face, I've stayed with Face, all of them in Festac, so they are all my buddies. But because of you know, time, we've not seen each other for some time. So I, 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 I pray and I hope one day I will have to face on the show to, to talk his own side of the story of the Plantation Boys history and face to talk his own side of the story of the Plantation Boys history. So we just heard from Blackface now. He has said his own part and I hope you learned a lot too from it. So thank you guys as we come to the end of this episode, episode three. So watch out for episode four. It's going to be special because we are going international this time. You know how our music is cutting across borders, how it's doing abroad. That's our, our next episode is going to be episode 4. So I'm not going to reveal it to you. So just turn on your notification so you get a pop-up when we're dropping this next episode. So you can be a first witness to it. Thank you guys for hanging out with the Off Tape Show. It's your boy Jeff the Roller. See you again. Peace. Welcome to the Off Tape Show. Subscribe to the YouTube channel now and turn on your notification.